parkour. First lesson. You motherfucker! I don't. I, I'm not. That's a great start. Yes. Yeah. 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 I. I need the portal. From from. Parkour! Hey guys, today we're going to the horse track with my Italian father. He's gonna teach us the ropes. Let's go! <laughs> Alright, so we're going to Belmont. Partially because my dad just wants to gamble. Partially because he's wanted to make a video of some kind. So, I don't know. Maybe he'll actually have some inside Brooklyn Italian knowledge. A.K.A. fixed races. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> I got the horse right here. <laughs> the <laughs> Can you do. got the old timey hat. Is he ready to teach me horse race stuff? As long as you got money. Do you honestly have a strategy at all when you look at the guides? And what are the main criteria? Speed. You know, how fast the horse ran the last time. I would think speed would be pretty important. <laughs> <laughs> and then what's the other criteria besides speed? Well, horse boys look at a whole bunch of things. Breeding, you know. They watch video of them having sex. Some horses like certain tracks. How come, the colors? It's like white, white people cock fighting, white people dog fighting. I don't have a feel for if horse racing is more like Baccarat, the Asian people writing stuff down for no reason, or it's like poker where people are studying. On that spectrum, I sense it's closer to Baccarat, but I don't want to disrespect your art, Fada. No, it's more science. I think horse racing is more scientific. Secretariat is here today, that's why it's crowded. I was there when Barbaro died, guys. Is this where they live? Is this the horse houses? Or the jockey houses? What's the first thing to analyze? Should we be looking at the way the leaves are blowing? Tell me, fill me in, come on. Wow, I'm so used to only like the aqueduct in like Empire City. This is already way nice. Deposit only, it's like there's no need. We're not gonna win, so it's just like a one-way window. I feel like I'm going entering a degenerate amusement park. Wow. Wow, Dad. So the first lesson is when you run in and you're late for the first race, you have to see how many minutes you have to post on so you can get your first pass. <laughs> Even if you know nothing about the horses. 12 minutes to post time, and this is race number two. All right, let's go. So this, this is the classic degenerate looking area I'm used to. This is what I know. Like, this is what I know. <laughs> the many screens, the watching. So what, what, what are we looking at here? Their, their, their thigh, their butt, their eyeballs. How about the jockeys? Any an analyzing them? Their mood? I do look to see if people are like looking or talking or the people that are walking out with the horses say anything. Like people see if you overhear anything? Here. Yeah. What might they say? He's feeling really good today. Oh really? Yeah, I heard a guy say that last time and, he, and the horse won. Owners of the horse oh. were right next, was standing right next oh, to me shit. right here. And he said he's feeling really good. I'll see you in a minute. And he won. I was like... How about these people? Uh, what time do they race? You want to really feel a DJ we go to the grandstand. Where the guy saved the $5 admission fee. <laughs> we got that post-colossus checking account where you don't pay the fees. So we could be reckless degenerates anywhere. Well, I thought they give me 20. It's like a ghetto ATM. This is like an official DJ. What is this, like Disney dollars for the racetrack? My dad already went to put in a fucking bet. I haven't even, I like, haven't even found the book. He's like, oh, I'm just gonna go put in this exacto. I'll be right back. I'm really trying to learn about the analytics and he doesn't seem, he seems to be falling immediately into just regular degenerate uh, maneuvers or whatever. Where is he? There he is, wandering with his boot. Dad, do a parkour. No, I'm kidding. Wait, what would you bet? I want to bet on this race. One, three, and seven. Why? I don't know. It was only four minutes left. All right. He's already annoyed. He's bailing on the tutorial after the first. All we were doing analytics video. Well, thanks for helping me, bro. I mean, you just abandoned me. I didn't have time to do anything. Right. You just got all degenerate and left on me the first bet of the day. I had but... to get action. <laughs> Point of this is you're supposed to teach. You don't even have a book. You don't even know any racers. One, three, and seven. But, That's my analytics. But next, you're allowed a pee break, but then we got to do the analytics, all right? Yes. <laughs> That's funny, most places that just be called the resources office, but they gotta specify horse or human here. But um, I don't know what that means. Mutual information and change. Yo, I got information, you got information, let's exchange. I think that we should bet on this. How much did you risk on it? $12 and I get 44 back. Help look out for the books, we gotta do that research. Thanks. 
now we got to look. We don't look miserable <laughs> enough yet. We haven't we haven't lost enough races, but I think that these are the first two parts of the look. The pen, the crumpled up thing. You gotta hold the form and act like you're really doing analytics. Wait, what are these unlabeled horses? I've noticed here, it seems like a clear like cast system where it's like the degenerates come for free at the grandstand. Then there's us like the $5 middle class. <laughs> then you can have a box seat for like a little bit more with reserved, right? $3 you can get a handicapper seat, whatever the fuck that means. And then there's this, the fucking ruling class elite with the slave auction stands. And look at that. They're just sitting in the middle walking on the track. How do we get there? Seven furlongs, it's the grass. Last race, Berkey to number one. Ran at Belmont at seven night. Conditions of the track, yeah. good, firm, the times. Class of the race and how it ran. What place it was in? Yeah. A few moments later. The analytics for this race, since we don't have a lot of time, was what? He hasn't ran since August. Maybe Swamp he's rat, And he's running a shorter distance. Then what? And he ran the last two times. All right, so that's that's the GTO play so far. The races keep coming. It's like rapid roulette. Like it keeps making you bet. Seven and who though? You're not just gonna do seven to win. But there's seven and one, like the last time. Why I mean, one? What's your analytics for one? Nothing. None. Jesus. A few moments later. What? Uh, win place show. Four, four, and four. What? It doesn't we're, look like a close. Why okay, we're in last place? Well rested. He's way in the back. Hmm? Here he comes. Race that side, Come on. 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 I didn't even know that was the finish line. You don't. And you gave me a bad pick. Oh, seven came in third. I guess it makes sense that every time a, a, a result comes in, that seven eighths of the people are like, "Fuck!" One one eighth are like, "Yeah." Whatever, I'm down like 40 bucks or something. I didn't realize they pay like 38 to one or I wouldn't have put $20 on each. So let's study this next one, please, for real. A few moments later. All right, so let's go, what's going on here is that there's only a four horse race next. One of them is one to nine. Why is he even in this class race? What the fuck? Which I don't know what right-minded degenerate would do that anyway, but the three horse is 19 to one, he's a long shot. But, it, but my basic understanding of these analytics, that speed matters, it looks like he ran fast. So I don't, I, I'm, I think I'm just gonna bet the house on three, all right? My dad, he just cut a bunch of people in line. I tried to tell him. I'm disappointed in you. What do you have to say about cutting line? Respond to the line cutting accusations. I apologize, because I didn't realize. <laughs> I thought they thought they were amateurs and just waiting on some, the wrong line. My defense is that they, were, they weren't standing directly in front of the window. I don't buy this defense. I think you really fucked up there. They got the little outdoor betting window and stuff. Look at that sign, that's gangster. Visit your local bookie, you bet on college football since it's a Saturday and watch the game right here. Yeah, that's sick. I'm sure that's what everyone's doing. Ah, oh, there's three. Look at him. Three's out to a great start. <laughs> Come on. Oh no. Oh my god, look how close. Oh! oh. Oh look, they're, they like collided at the, at the gate, yeah. You know what, I'm gonna pull a victim Joey here and say that they just showed footage of the three colliding, that's all that happened. I think my analytics are still sound. <laughs> that's so fucking crazy. Back to the drawing board with our analytics, Dad. This so is, wait, so this, this next a... race is all female horses, Dad? It's all fillies, you're saying? Old, like that's so boring, it's like the WNBA. Let's just skip <laughs> this race. Why are we gonna watch female horses? <laughs> The sections are what you think, like the outside picnic area has the families and the inside on a nice day are just all the sick degens. Can you show me the ropes of the, of the, what about like your mafia friends who have like a tip on like a horse, like can we do some of that? <laughs> Work on it, make some calls in the bathroom. I love these so much, like I love, I love that they have kid stuff there because it's always like, it's like you just spent the day at the track and you're like, oh fuck, I gotta get my kid something. Greatest really ever. They had to put it down. Look how big she is. That's how much secretary it won by. When you sign up for the Tibet Mobile, they ask who your favorite jockey is. Is one of your security questions. Oh look, it's like a life-size one. <laughs> Parkour. Oh. Yeah. 
Oh, he's wanted. He's wanted. He's wanted. I'll give you his name. What do you want to talk about? How we keep losing over here? He says it right there. It's sounding like the Paulo degenerate. This is from promoting. The old degenerate gambler. Watch my phone. I admit it. Let's get it, Mikey. I'll say one thing. You got to be out of your mind to bet Goldstein. You're at Belmont right, right now. So is that what you were arguing about? Yes. 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 Oh, you I, I, I bet Belmont and I bet cockroaches. That's my huh? I don't want to hear that. Uh, listen, right. I it's said, like three separate degenerate rants going on at once. How could you bet two one to five shots battling it out Shut down up the already. I'm Take telling them. Down the stretch. <laughs> who, who, who do you guys so like in the next? We go, we go, go, we go to Goop. I'll give you the winner at Goldstream. Brian right. DePaulo, degenerate gambler. Whoop, 617. Thanks. Right. A few moments later. DJ's in training. Did he off? Wait a second. Is this yeah. against gambling right now? No, he's just no. I play poker like, like I, I. I love gambling. No, I no no no. I, it's called Ryan. No, DePaul, if you go to a baseball game, game, it's five hundred dollars. But I never do horse racing. I came with my dad. Are they're worried. Cut us out? They're getting worried that I'm gonna edit like it's like a political documentary. Yeah, no, we, like I am the. Say, I'm a gambler. I'm, I'm with you guys. Put me in. Put this is, you know why? Because he's a tool. That's no. I just hope my exacta wins that I gave out. If not, I'll. John and Anthony, you. Oh, I'm doing this for you. Yeah. Come here, Jack. Yeah. Take Tell another me. picture. Yeah. Well, they're video. They're moving pictures. Degenerate. So you guys Nobody. come here every weekend or what? Richard out? lives here. This is his chair. He's glued to it. <laughs> every week. How do you like honestly share with each other your picks? Like, like or no. are you afraid it'll fuck up the? Like, no, no, uh, it's no. not enough Certain to. Some people there's horns in our life, but not today. What's for that? Them. That's what that's the called. Horn is for the jinxes. It's you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like a mush. I want my best friend mush. Yeah, jinxes. One of my good friends on the channel is a mush. Don't do that. Yeah, yeah. The Leave me alone. That's it. Cut. What? Yeah, yeah. What do you want? Uh, when place to show on number seven. The sire is American Pharaoh. Brian. <laughs> yeah. Gave it the exact third Gulf Stream. One six. I tell you, box one six five. It came. How could I? I was filming. I didn't even get to put it. But yeah, I. You. I you. Now you got clout. <laughs> you hear it here first, guys. If you come to Belmont, come over here, and he'll sell you picks. Right, free roll. Like, you give the tip, if it wins, pay you half. You're screwing them, they don't know. A few moments later. The extent of the tip I was able to gather was horse number four, Dad, from them, okay? How do you feel about this race? You think we're going to win, finally? Yes. I won the first race. Are they in the grass? Where the fuck are they? Let's go. Come on, you motherfucker! Come on! Come on, four. Come on, four. Show them who you are, baby! Way to go, Castellano! Your day today, baby! I caught him, you fucking cunt! You didn't even realize you were you were filming me. You won. Oh, awesome. Nice. Look at you. That's what I get for abandoning my own family. My dad bet on horse seven, and I just went with the guy's tip of four, the, 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 the local D-Gen. I betrayed my own blood that I'm smoking a cigar. It's a victory cigar, Dad. A few moments later. Some, somebody raised an objection. Meaning he either bumps a body or cuts somebody oh, off. Yeah, it's an objection against the seven. He came in on the one. The only thing I could say is I bet place on show, so if he goes to second, it wouldn't be a disaster. If he gets the squall play. It's so go, sick that there is such rule for room for corruption in it. That's so amazing. I feel like that leaves room for fuckery. No, in the Belmont Stakes, or was it the Kentucky Derby? Oh, yeah, yeah. It was an objection. I thought it was like go-karts, like you are supposed to cut them off. You can, but it, oh, not if they have to check the horse. All right, bye, guys. Guys, see you later, man. Bye. bye. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Bye, guys. Good luck. That's where we belong. Inside? Inside. With the D-Gens. If we bring Katie here, this is where we go. This is the part where you try to convince whoever you drag with you and your family to the track that it's like, look, it's like a fun day out. It's like a picnic. Yeah, and you always say you won. Yeah, you yeah. How much you I know, seriously. Dude, it's like an episode of Intervention. It's sad. I saw this lady was like, guess where we're going today to her son. And he's like, she's like, dun 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 And he's like, no! Oh, wow. That's so cool. They have a, a photo signed by Secretariat. So to me, it seems clear that Baccarat gobbledygook is the conclusion. I don't want to offend my dad, but it seems like this is just a bunch of degenerate shit. Oh, sorry. Hey, Dad. It was just in the lady, the men's room, what? and a guy punched his girlfriend in the face. Are you serious? Yeah, they're right there. The story seems unclear, but what a, what a cap to a degenerate day is to have uh, have my dad witness domestic violence. All right, 
So what did we learn? We learned that there are degenerates here just like any other gambling place. My dad doesn't know as much as I thought he would, and the analytics are a little bit fugity jeedy. So fucking, I don't know what the word is. Or we don't know them. And, uh, and parkour. That's it. Thank you for watching. Please share. Please subscribe. Please do all them things. Please free the horses. Two hours later. Amendment to the video that I got home, came across horse racing, hours later, realized I still have money in the account. Let me risk fucking like $85 on this last race. I asked Katie to pick a horse. She picked horse number three. And look at that boy. He only pays like two to one. But look at him winning by a fucking a hoof link. Wow. That was fun. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All the skill in jockeying is like who can beat their animal harder. The old Shug Magogany.